good afternoon internet how are you guys going today it's another beautiful day today and uh, excuse the sun it could be on my face i'm not sure but um today we're gonna be trying to clean up this guy over here make him look a little bit more shinier okay <laughs> um before i continue i'd like to actually thank you guys for a lot of i've been getting a lot of subscribers and uh, this is really amazing guys so we're gonna try and uh, make sure that we clean up this guy my little young fella over here who i love so much i've just given him a wash and we're gonna be doing some spray okay let me go inside oh i need to get uh, i need to get the keys otherwise we cannot go inside so this actually this you can actually do this by yourself you know um i always like yeah to have a car that looks a little bit it's a cheap car but clean car you know so and it's uh it's like my baby you know which i love so much we're gonna go inside and uh i'll show you how it looks like over here this is my baby <laughs> That I love so much. Um, if you're wondering what car is this, this is actually a 2014 Mazda 6, um, and uh, I bought this car second hand. And I always encourage anyone: if you wanna buy a car, buy a car second hand. Don't buy a brand new car. And I cannot explain much about that, but out of experience and out of what I've seen from a lot of people out there that um, buying a second hand car is actually really really good because number one um, you don't need to worry about like mortgage and stuff like that you don't need to worry about um, uh, insurance you don't need to worry about certain things you know like you know I prefer buying because like what I'm trying to say is like buying a new car is like it's good to have a new car I'm not saying it's wrong but you just think about the depreciation of buying a new car so it's better for you to buy a second hand car probably cash and then you don't need to worry about the loan that you're gonna pay for years if you wanna buy something maybe a land or something you can buy it with a mortgage or if you wanna buy um, a uh, a house you know that's something I'll, I'll recommend but for car guys out there don't buy don't buy a brand new car just buy a second hand car this is a second hand car that I have here and uh, it's, it's, it does the job for me and I love it and probably buy it if it's mostly less than for me hundred and thirty thousand K that's enough okay so that's not the topic for today the topic for today we're gonna be spraying the wheels okay we're gonna be spraying the wheels and I've got this guy over here this guy over here is called rust guard and I always do this like twice a year for my for this car just to keep my wheels like a little bit you know shiny and and uh, we're gonna try and doing it now you see how it looks like this time so that's how my wheels look like but we're gonna spray it and make it look a little bit more darker than this so I'll show you after and before okay so let's give this guy a check and then we're gonna do it So I've just done the first bit uh, of paint or the spray paint actually um, my Mazda is a, it's a Mazda 6 um, and it's gray in color but the thing is I always try to get a darker version of the spray paint and then I put on my wheels which is actually really good so I prefer using something like a darker one or a gray for a Mazda 6 for the wheels it actually makes the car look more um, as you can see it's actually like sort of stands out it's an old car but you can't even tell if it's an old, it's an old car and uh for me a car like i said before is all about maintenance you know like making it look you know look if i want to sell it i'm, I'm gonna sell it some good money good cash so i prefer just making sure that you try to maintain it and and uh of course take it like your own like your, yourself you know like how you take care of yourself so yeah so i've done the first coating already and uh, it actually looks really good i'm not yet finished with it i'm still gonna keep going and uh, do another coat around because i bought two of these and then i'm gonna sort of reverse the car behind so that i can actually face because one like one painting it doesn't actually go both sides of the rim so i have to reverse the car a little bit or forward the car forward a little bit and then i can actually spray some parts which you can't see from here so yeah i'll just like i'll just show you what i mean so if you see if i like down this side maybe you can't see from here but on this side i have to reverse the car or forward the car because probably forward it so that i can actually get those spots over there so i'll just do another coat again and 
it actually looks really cool. <laughs> so this is just a tip, you know, of you know, if you have a car, whatever type it is, if you take good care of it, you know. Yeah, when I bought this car, the, the, the rims were actually silver and I didn't like it because it didn't match the car. So the car is sort of grey. Actually it's grey but you can think that it's black. So, and the grey and the black actually go really well. So some, some of the tips just to give you out there. So um, I'll go ahead and give it another spray and uh, see how it looks after we finish. Actually, if you look from this side, if you look from this side, it looks more like it's, you know, it's coming up. You see how green it is. It's actually like very shiny. And um, this will actually stay. Like, probably I haven't done the best job, but usually I prefer like, like having like a, and give it a nice sandpaper. I think for today, I'll just do it that way. And I think it just does the job. It's a good thing. Yeah, so anyone can do this. You can do this for your car. When you're having a free day, whatever, do that to your car. And uh, it looks really good at the end of the day. So let's... Yeah, maybe another hint, it's just because I didn't, I forgot to actually get myself a mask. Always a good idea to have like a mask to protect yourself from inhaling this paint. But um, I'm trying to play up with the wind. So whenever the wind is going, that's where I'm actually like giving my body towards to. So, but um, it's actually like coming nicely. So I've got another one here, usually I buy one, but today I just bought two just in case. And one is always enough for me. So. I'm gonna give it another coat of this one and then um, I see how it go and then before I give it another coat I'll move the car forward and then uh, you know try to give it a coat which is now I'll show you what I was, I was saying you see like so this side if you can see so this side there's no there's no there's no paint the same thing at the back there's no paint on the on that side as well so just moving in the car forward a little bit helps it to you know have that sort of space for me to paint over here over there that's what I was saying about like I wish I could um, have a like a uh, what do you call it? My mind is blank now. Um, paper, hand sandpaper. So like, I could have actually give it a scrub, but can't be bothered now. But yeah, it still does the job anyway. Yep. So let's go. Let's keep going. There you go guys my mazda is ready to rumble again <laughs> uh yes look at it. it looks really cool nice and shiny yes see how it looks like So there you go guys, you don't need to get a brand new car, you can make your car look brand new by just making it how you want it to look like, you know, like maintaining it, washing it and uh, accepting, accepting actually what it is, like I like this car the way it is, an old car, but it looks like a new car, so um, that's just a short, shiny, ready to go, um, yeah, 
So that was just a short video for me guys to you. Um, it doesn't take you much time. Sorry, the sun is very, very hot, but I have to be here anyway. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna give it time to dry and uh, maybe I will not drive it today, maybe tomorrow. Yeah, but yeah, look at it, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, you can do this. How much does this one cost me? One of them was uh, $16. I think sixteen dollars each, so off to that's uh, thirty-two dollars, thirty-two dollars or thirty yeah thirty-two dollars. That was actually really good, yeah. And uh, it, it will stay like this for another six or something months, and then we do it again. But in the meantime, it's just to get it washed, and um, yeah, looks like a good car, nice color. It does the job. Always buy an old car, guys. Don't buy a brand new car, especially on a loan. That's my idea to you. That's my only advice. If you can afford it, go ahead. But I prefer an old car and maintain it, maintain it the way you want. And um, it's gonna be, you know, your favorite toy for the rest of your life. So yeah, that's it for me guys. I'll, uh, I'll leave it at that. Probably should go inside the house and have something to eat. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. Tell me what you think in the comments below. Um, improving every day. We're almost to 600 subscribers guys. I appreciate your job. My video is all about positivity, learning something new and having a good time. Um, that's it guys. Um, I think I think we're doing pretty well and to my new subscribers, thank you very much for joining the family. Um, we're still having more to come and um, I really appreciate your time watching my videos in as much as they're not the best but I really appreciate it and I hope you learn something or two from it and i uh, hope it gives you some positive feedback wherever you are and all the challenges that come through with life so that's it for me peace out